Meanwhile, all is set for the Wiper Party National Delegates meeting scheduled for tomorrow at the Kasarani Indo Arena. 6,000 delegates are expected at the annual meeting, which will also be used to decide the party's way forward ahead of the 2022 general election. Zainab Said with more details. The final touches ahead of Thursday's delegate meeting for the Waipa party. It is during tomorrow's meeting at the Kasarani Indo Arena that the party will unveil its leader, Kalonzo Musioka, as their presidential candidate and also give him mandate to negotiate with same-minded party leaders and parties ahead of the 2022 general election. The new party officials appointed by NEC are also expected to be endorsed. Meanwhile, Embu Senator Njeru Ndigwa has raised concern over rising culture of political intolerance in the country ahead of the 2022 polls. This is not time for political intolerance. This country wants peace and all the, all the top presidential aspirants, all of them are talking about two main things, peace and economy. So we do not want other... Uh, uh, fellows who want other political positions to misuse our young people. Still in matters elections, the church has called on political leaders to preach message of peace as they campaign for the 2022 general election. Speaking in Lodwa at a conference that brought together Glory Outreach Ministries church leaders from Ethiopia, South Sudan, Uganda, West Pokot, Laikipia and Baringo counties, the Glory Outreach Ministries church archbishop Benson Ekwom denounced politicians who spread hatred among the community. Sisi kama Turkana kama Pokota tutaki mtu yote atutumie katika ziaza zake maana tumeenjoy tunatunajua tuna amani ni kitu muhimu For Prime Edition I'm Zainab Said